determined after we uh, uh, come up with the um, get the legislation done. So it's going to be somewhere in the cities. You know, I'd like to think it's going to be somewhat urban, but you know, we honestly, you know, we've talked to RT, we've talked to the city of St. Paul, Brooklyn Center. So we've got a lot of folks to talk to yet and figure out where. It's Come on, to Hugo. Hugo. Okay. What's that? Hugo. It's not going to be in Hugo. <laughs> So you guys pulled back distribution because you guys couldn't keep up with that. Are you guys expanding, planning to go back to Chicago and those areas uh, down the road? Or is that going to wait until you guys get the new, the new brewery yeah, set up? I don't think there's much chance of us getting back to Chicago, Wisconsin, South Dakota unless we build a new brewery because we still have like three or four hundred stores waiting for beer here in the Twin Cities. So it keeps growing. We keep growing, but it's not enough. So I, I think it will take us a long time to get back to those markets. Well, yes, sir. Oh, I don't know if we're gonna package Moe's Bender. That's uh, that's uh, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. That one's kind of a special event beer, so uh, there are no plans at the moment, but we'll see. We'll see. So, yes, sir. Yeah, we have a farmer that gets them all. He comes by about every day and picks them all up, and he uh, uh, gives them to. He has a number of uh, hog and cattle that he feeds it to, and shares it with some of his neighbor farmers. So it's, it, all, it all ends up being feed. So we, we pull out a lot of the nutrients, a lot of the sugars we need, but there's still a lot of nutrients in it uh, for, for livestock. Pretty much every brewer's got a farm. Yeah. Have you had any infections here? Uh, we have not as of yet. Yeah. What's that? Oh, I'm a big fan of uh, Founders, like Founders Red Rye, and a big fan of a bunch of the Stone beers. Love Three Floyd stuff. So. Uh, What's your favorite too? Wet. But when I'm at home, or when I'm in the cities, I'm usually drinking a Surly, so. Uh, when I'm out of town, I'm usually trying to drink something local, so. Well, very good. Thank you all for coming on out, and uh, you're all now officially members of Surly Nation, so go forth and spread the word.